We're now going to move to playing a single note. And the single note's important because that's what this instrument was meant to play. Along with those, the chords. It does both of those. Mm -hmm. It's a harmonica. It does harmony. Right. So the melody and chords, it can do both. To play melody, we need to achieve a single note. Okay. And it, once we can get a clean, individual single note, mm -hmm. then we can start having some fun with dirtying it up. Okay. And there are a lot of ways to present one note on the harmonica. And by far, that's the cool thing on the harmonica. It is its greatest strength is its ability to play one note in so many different ways. Very simplistic instrument. Comb, reed plate, holding reeds, cover plate. But it has an amazing array of different ways it can present one yeah. note. But it all starts with a single note. Okay. Do be aware of though, that if you oops are not playing a single note, which you're gonna have a lot of oops, most of the time it's gonna be oops, is that uh, when you play more than one note, it actually sounds good, it sounds like a harmony. So the harmonica is built in harmonies. So if I'm trying to play the fourth hole blow, and oops, I have some five in there, sounds kinda good. So even if you're playing it wrong, it still sounds musical. Yeah. Our goal is to get a single note, okay. but be nice to yourself. It takes a couple months okay. before single notes become consistent. Yes. You want to strive for that, but be okay with a little bit of chordal stuff. Okay. It still sounds good. Okay. Okay. Now, how that's achieved. <laughs> Today, we're going to focus on hole four and above. We are not going to do holes one, two, and three okay. for single notes. Our okay. next lesson will go into that. Okay. Now, it'll be evident why we're not doing that just as of yet. Your default position is to have your lips over four holes. Mm -hmm. So you're going to be blocking, or your lips are going to be over one, two, three, four. So let's blow. It's going to require your mouth to be a little larger, actually, than we were just playing. Oops, there I am again with my hand. Hold on. There See? you go. Good. Good. That C's helping. Okay. Good. Yeah, move to your left just a touch. Good. You now have holes yeah. one, two, three, and four in there. Okay. Now, when playing that chord, we're going to slowly, I'm going to kind of over describe this and then we'll get in and do it. You're going to slowly place your tongue on the harmonica on holes one, two, and three. I want to be very specific on what part of your tongue. Okay. We're not using the very tippy tip. Mm -hmm. It's not wide enough to block three holes. Mm -hmm. You would have to mash the tongue on there. Mashing the tongue is going to cause you to push which is going to cause you to slow down and have a little abrasions on your tongue and that won't be any fun. So instead of using the tip of the tongue, which is not wide enough, we're going to be using the tip top called the blade. Okay. Simply put, the more holes you want to block, the more of the top of the tongue you use. Okay. So we're going to adjust your hold just a tiny bit. Instead of having the harmonica dead flat, it's going to be slightly tilted downward. Okay. And that's achieved by pushing your thumb back just a little bit. So hold your harmonica, push your thumb. Wait. Okay, so your thumb is underneath this ridge right now, and if you push, you'll notice the face of the harmonica goes down. That's it, good. And all we need is just a little bit of angle. Here's why we do that. To use the top of our tongue with a flat harmonica, we would have to put our tongue <laughs> like that. But what if we tilt the harmonica and bring it in our mouth? Look at it. Got it, yeah, yeah. So easy to get a single note. Okay. The more flat and the more out the harmonica is, the more effort the tongue has to do to reach the sure. harmonica. By the way, Tons of fantastic players who play dead flat. Huh. They got to do that, and they're fine at it. Yeah. But if you tilt the harmonica, bring it into your mouth, it not only opens your mouth more, mm -hmm. which equals better tone, from an ergonomic standpoint. Makes sense. Yeah, it makes a lot of sense. So, yeah. it is helpful to have the face of the harmonica tilted downward to meet the surface of the tongue. Okay. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to be have my have my mouth over four holes. Okay. I'm going to have it. The tongue a little bit to the left at 11 o'clock angle. If you okay. think about like a clock sitting flat down, okay. noon would be here, 11 mm -hmm. o'clock would be to the left. Okay. So sticking my tongue out to the left, 11 o'clock angle, okay. using a little bit of the top, and lastly, a light touch. Okay. Let me do that a couple times so you can see it, and then I'll have you try it. I'm going to start by playing a chord and slowly go into a single note. You won't be able to see it yet, you're going to hear it, then I'll take the harmonic away. Good try. Forget it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hold on. This thing again. 
And again, we may just not hold the harmonica that way for a moment, just so you can focus on your mouth. So I'll leave that up to you. Okay. All right, so blocking the three, tilting. Yeah, so let's play holes one, two, three, four, blow first. Make sure you're over the right holes. Okay. Close, you're a little small. Make your mouth larger. Okay. Open your mouth more. Good, good, your tilt looks good. Now slowly, put your tongue on there. Very good, 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 good. Yeah, the tone's a little wimpy at the very end and that's to be expected. <laughs> Again. No, hold on. Mm -hmm. Take your time, do as many times as you need. So bad. It's my uh, thumb that's getting in the way too. Okay. I want to hold it like, I want to go like this. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay, hold on. Okay, let's try this again. Wait. Very good. That's so wimpy at the bottom. At the end. It, it doesn't matter, you're getting a single note, so that's just fine. The tone will get better with time. Okay. Now tap out your harp. And once you're able to play a single note, you're going to slide. Oh, forget it. <laughs> and just maybe two or three holes to the right. So the harmonica is sliding to the left. And your tongue is still blocking? Yes. Oh so my, my gosh. mouth and tongue are remaining the same. Jeez. So what's happening is now this harmonica is moving like a carriage. Oh, your tongue is the same. As my tongue and my mouth yeah. stays the same. Okay. There's a, in Trossing in Germany, there's a, a museum. Mm -hmm. And they have this harmonica playing robot, which is basically an air compressor that sits in front of the harmonica, and the harmonica moves like a carriage in front of this little air compressor. We're that air compressor, so it just moves. Yeah. So that's that's the idea. So let's give it one more time. Try to find that single note. Good. Now slide up. Move your harmonica to the left. <laughs> Your lips are probably move it, dry. Move the harmonica to the left. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. And it'll move you up the harmonica. Oh my gosh. Keep going. Oh, very good. <laughs> yeah. The <laughs> single note sounded good. Cute. Good. Now tap out the harp because you're probably drooling in your harmonica. And um, now we're going <laughs> to. Don't look upset. ask me to do that again. <laughs> <laughs> now uh, do the same thing. We're going to inhale. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. I can't even do it. Blowing into it, I'm going to have to inhale. This is more unnatural. Okay. This is so weird. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. Okay. Exhale before you start. Now the bottom note is open right now, so that you're forgetting about your 11 o'clock angle. Keep your tongue to the left. Oh, right. Okay, that's going to be another note. 11 o'clock. No. Yes, good. Now slide up. <laughs> that was it. Yeah, and you ran out of air. That's to be expected. You're going to run out of air a lot because you are you got a big chord going in a right. single note. Now, the reason why we are, yeah, you're going to get used to that. Uh, the reason why we're starting with our uh, <laughs> uh, tongue off the harmonica is so that you can hear it turn into a single note. As soon as you hear the single note stop. Otherwise, if we start with the tongue on the harmonica, most people push hard. Oh, yeah. Okay. So light, 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 light. Okay, I don't hear you. I don't hear you. Oh, I hear it. Stop. Okay. No, no more pushing. Okay. Eventually, you'll just start with your tongue on the harmonica because you're going to have a feel of sure. what it feels like to have the tongue right. on the harmonica. And it's a very light touch. Okay. Super, super light touch. Okay.